What's up guys? So these are the headlights from GRP. Well, they're my stock ones, but he took them and then the carbon fiber housing was replaced and also the rings, the halos there, they're red now before I didn't have any. Anyways, here's his website and it even comes to a little remote. Ooh. It feels hot. It's only 90 degrees, but it feels pretty hot. Next is take out the car and start. the alarm under the car there's an actual jack behind the passenger front wheel there not just that now it's time to uh remove the splash guard oh the reason you guys are there is because unfortunately my gopro isn't charging something's wrong with it what can you do actually you know what let's just move you guys over gotta remove this and these two for this to come off Whenever I unscrew them, they don't always like to cooperate. So what I'll do is twitch this, I'll twist. Okay, so plug, plug, and these two, this one, and this one. Now it's time to uh, fit the lights. I'm cleaning up the seal. It's pretty, uh, pretty dirty. Right now I'm installing the hardware. These are 17 millimeters, the big ones. This nut is a uh, eight millimeter. For the one in here, I have to use a wrench, in this case a ratchet wrench. Remember, this one goes at the very top. I don't know if you guys remember on my last episode, but I took pictures of things. I don't know if you guys can see that. Yeah, right there. Just helps out. Negative on the left, positive on the right. Bada bing, bada boom. Ooh, maybe. helps if you face that clip the right way. Now let's just hope everything works. The tools I ended up using is a 17mm, a ratchet wrench with a 17 also, a pair of diagonal cutters, flathead, 8mm wrench, Phillips, breaker bar, and then a torque wrench for the lug nuts. Don't forget to zip tie your cables up in the wheel well unfortunately i already covered it but i took a picture and i'll show you guys what i'm talking about now we just got to make sure the hids work well on this side guess you could say things are getting kind of serious Look at that. Whew. Now it's just time to button everything up and uh, we'll be good to go. And I gotta do the other side, but pretty sure you guys get the gist. On a quick note, since we're already here, if you look at all this, 
this material it's gotta go away so my plan is probably start about right here if not a little higher start cutting this all around and I gotta be careful over here because of that mesh so I'll probably cut around right here and then just stop right about here well guys that's it hope you enjoyed this video till next time